This movie tells a story about Sarah, a single mother that's been pushed to her limit dealing with the recent loss of her father. After noticing the strange behavior of her young daughter, she must challenge her own values and confront a ghost from her past. First of all, this movie actually starts decent. Unfortunately, it runs out of steam sooner than later. The movie aims for a slow burn, attempting to explore generational trauma through the eyes of a grief-stricken woman. However, the film never bothers to turn the heat up and plays in a very familiar beats. The movie has a scenario rife with vulnerability, but it only manifests dread by employing lazy tropes which we see in many other modern horror movies. The movie is riddled with genre cliches, it becomes ploddingly tedious and leaves the fever treading tepid water. The performance of the two main actors is good, unfortunately, aside from that, the movie has little to offer. This movie is actually quite successful at setting a nice stage in the first act. However, the family mystery is obvious and anticlimactic. Instead of coming up with anything original or even something familiar that moves at a good pace, this movie devolves into a series of repetitive scenes that keep spinning around a painfully obvious reveal that the movie takes far too long to unleash. The movie repeats the same scene over and over again, with Mia making an ominous statement and then running away after Sarah scolds her for her spooky behavior. It fails to generate the tension required to keep the audience interested in Mia's bizarre proclamations or Sarah's emotional distress. The characters lack interesting arc and personality, while the family dynamics are rather monotonous. Initial arguments between Sarah and Mia are intense, but they become increasingly muted, hence negating the impact of the violent relationship between mother and daughter. The script gives the main actress little room to move, so even though she is strained by the tragedy in her life, her character is decidedly one note. As a horror movie, this is also not scary. The movie never really tips into spooky territory enough. For almost the whole movie, we have expectation that something monumental is about to occur. Unfortunately, the resolution doesn't make sense or leaves little to no explanation for the preceding events. Overall, we do not recommend to watch this in theaters. Just wait on your free TV channel.